Oh, goody. All right, what's up, everybody? It is Zombies here again, and today we have a different kind of video. So today I wanted to talk to you about Hearthstone Deck Tracker and some benefits it provides to the play experience in Mercenaries. So if you do not already know, Hearthstone Deck Tracker is a great third-party application that basically, as the name says, tracks your decks in Hearthstone. Um, initially, it was mainly focused towards Constructed, and it does some great job in that uh, space, but they've also expanded it to include more modes, including Mercenaries, and the quality of life improvements it gives in Mercenaries are really, really great, in my opinion. So going over what those are here, as you can see on the screen, we are in a PvE game here, loaded up with the fire comp. And if you'll notice below, we have our abilities with numbers below our characters. And the enemy units, we actually have their abilities above them. So this is not normally present in the game. And I think it is a really, really awesome thing to just kind of give you a quick visual reminder of what skills your opponent has available, as well as what speeds they are on, because speed is a very, uh, speed control is a very relevant thing in the mercenaries meta. So being able to uh, quickly keep up with what is slowed, what is sped up is very, very important, especially in PVP. If you'll notice when you hover over a mercenary on the right hand side here, you actually get to see all of their skills. So that is a really handy thing. This does also apply to opponents mercenaries in PVP. So if you are newer to the mode or if you're just seeing something that you don't typically run into, like maybe Alex Straza here in PVP and you don't remember what all her abilities do, you can just mouse over her and you get right there on the side, nice and accessible, easy to read. And it's just a really, really nice feature. Um, this is actually a kind of design I would love for them to incorporate into the base game eventually. I think it really does make things a little bit easier. And definitely if you're playing in a longer play session, for me, I find it makes it much more enjoyable to play uh, because I don't have to remember like another big set of things on top of all the other things I have to think about in Mercenaries PvP as there's usually a lot going on with math and deciding what to target and so on and so forth but it is a uh, it's a really useful tool for those reasons and on top of that Speaking as a content creator and someone who likes to watch a lot of mercenary stuff, I find that when I'm watching mercenaries content, having the tracker overlay, which I'm using now, is just so useful for keeping up with the game as mercenaries combat happens really, really fast. So sometimes, um, you know, as a streamer or as a viewer, it's easy to just miss like a little bit of kind of the, the combat phase and not see like a critical slow or something that happened that could drastically alter the play line. And so having this there to kind of just give you a reminder about um, what an ability is at is really, really useful and I think just makes for a much better play experience. So though that is uh, that is the main thing that I really like about it. Um, on top of that, we do have a very convenient little tasks fire down here. And if you mouse over that, you can see you actually can view your mercenaries tasks right from anywhere in the game, whether in your in the menu or in a match of PVE or PVP. You can view them at any time, which is great. So that way you can double check how close you are to finishing your tasks and progressing on to the next one. That way you don't forget to clear one, other things like that. It's just really nice being able to do that without having to go 
all the way back to the menu or all the way down to the campfire in a bounty. So that's another really enjoyable feature that just makes for some nice quality of life upgrades. So those are the things I really like about uh, Deck Tracker. Definitely recommend it for those reasons. If you do want to get it, we will pull up their uh, website here. So you can find this at hsreplay.net slash downloads. And I'll leave a link in the description. So Hearthstone Deck Tracker is for Windows. Um, they do have a Mac client as well. That is HS Tracker. I've actually used that myself on my laptop as when I do farming. Usually it's on my phone or my laptop. So they actually uh, have a Mac version that works really well. And they have added the mercenaries features to the Mac version, which is really cool because I don't know if it, I don't think it had them on launch. So it's nice to see uh, some additional support for other people playing the mode on Macs. So I was really happy to see that. Um, but it is free to download. You can download it here and it is just a really useful tool. HS replay has announced they are having some mercenaries features that are going to be coming. Um, here we can see they do have a, a mercenaries tab on the site coming soon. So we, we, uh, are going to be hearing more about that very soon. So look forward to that. And I'm sure deck tracker will, um, track games for whatever they end up doing for mercenaries. So if you do want to uh, be a part of contributing to that data, which is always super fun to take a look at for games like this, that's another great reason I would recommend downloading it. But that is going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, do remember to like and subscribe. And I will catch you in the next one. Peace.